Hey, what's up, you guys? It's been forever, and I'm so sorry that, you know, I haven't been making videos the past two days. I'm kind of a little bit of a procrastinator, so I got really overwhelmed with homework and stuff the past, like, two days. But I'm back now, and good thing, or the good thing is, is that the questions from days 17 and 18 are ones that really wouldn't apply to me anyway. So, I mean, it would have been super short videos, and nobody likes a 30-second video. Um, at least I don't. Um, but, so I'm going to go through those. God, my hair is just everywhere. I'm going to go through those, and then I'm going to start on, to, on today's, which is day 19. Um, <laughs> and, yeah, let's get started. So, day 17 question was favorite makeup artist. And I don't really have a favorite makeup artist. I just, you know, I do tutorials on YouTube, and even then I don't really watch that many tutorials. I don't even have a favorite person that does tutorials, so we'll just leave it at that. And then favorite nighttime look was number 18. And I don't really wear, like, a nighttime look. Um, my eyeshadow is pretty colorful anyway during the day. Like, today I have, like, I don't know if you can really see it, but it's like a copper on the lid, and then like, um, whatchamacallit, a shimmery brownish copper on the crease, and then some white in the highlight. So it's pretty, you know, maybe if I lean back, you can kind of see. I don't know. You can see it. <laughs> um, but it's pretty colorful to begin with, and if it's not you know, colorful, if I go more neutral th during the day, I'll just add, like, some color to it, or I'll just wear that out, so I don't really go anywhere that I need to be, like, boom, you know, every day, but, um, yeah, so let's move on to today's, which I actually have some products to show you, um, today's question is favorite concealer, and I have four concealers here, three for eyes and one for face, um, you guys have probably seen these in other videos, but I'm just going to, you know, show you them again. Um, the first one for face is the MAC uh, Studio Finish Concealer in the color NC20. I've never really had a face concealer before. This is like the first one I've actually, you know, bought. And I like it. It's maybe a tad too light for me, but with my foundation and everything, it kind of balances it out. And it's really creamy, you know, it's a thicker, you know, consistency, so you kind of have to warm it up with your fingers when you put it on your face. Um, but yeah, I really like it. You know, as far as a first concealer, I might not repurchase this again because it was kind of expensive. But, you know, it's good while it lasts, and, you know, maybe I will go get more, I'm not sure. But when, when the time comes, I'll make that decision. And then I have three uh, under eye concealers. The first one I don't really use that much. It's the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser for dark circles. It's the one with the little poof ball on the top. Um, and I don't really use it that much. I got the color fair. And I don't use it because I just never think of it. I have other the other two I like more, so... When I run out of one of the other two, which is going to be soon because it's very light right now, then I'll probably turn to using this more often. But it does give you a natural, you know, look. It doesn't really highlight anything. It just kind of covers everything, which is nice for every day. Um, the other one I was talking about that I really like is the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. I'm actually, I think I'm almost done with this one because it seems like super you know, light, and when I stick the brush in, like, I get some, but not nearly as much as I used to when I first got it, so I think I'm almost probably done with this concealer, which is kind of sad, because I really like it. Um, it just, again, gives you a more natural look, it doesn't really highlight anything, and it just, you know, covers up those dark circles, makes you look more awake. Um, and then the last one, which is my favorite, but I don't really use it that much, it's the Maybelline Dream Lumi Touch. It's very highlighting, so I don't use it all the time. But, um, again, I think I've showed it to you millions of times. It comes in the brush, 
you crank the top and then the um, product comes down to the brush and you just swipe and wipe and it just is beautiful it really like highlights and makes your eyes like just pop um, I'm not wearing it today I'm actually wearing the Rimmel wake me up kind but yeah so those are my favorite concealers you can like this video if you wear concealer of any kind and let me know what kind it is down below I will link the challenge down below so you can follow along every single day. And until tomorrow, definitely tomorrow, I will see you guys later. Bye.